Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Super Mario Maker 2. Today, we are checking out the brand new game mode added to the game in the brand new version 2.0 update. Of course, we started checking this out in the last episode with the new playable character, Link from the Legend of Zelda, but now we have Ninji speedruns. No active speedruns, so I think that means like speedruns that I'm doing? I don't really know how this game mode works, first and foremost, but I do know that it's like some kind of speedrunning thing. We have a stamp card. Oh, so maybe the more levels we complete, the more things we unlock, that'd be cool. So right now there is rolling snowballs. Make your way through the snow fields and keep an eye out for spikes and snow pokies. Stomping on snow pokies will turn them into small snowballs, which you can pick up and throw. Play this course as many times as you want and see if you can find the fastest way to finish. And you can see everybody's times as well. Whoa, okay, so a lot of people scored around 20 seconds. And if I wanna get the gold, I'll have to get faster than that. Huh, I love all the ninjas, they're so cute. So we'll try this out ourselves and see what our personal record will be. Okay. So I really don't know what to expect with this because I've never played the level before. Ninji Recon. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. First things first, take a deep breath and focus on clearing the course. I'm trying, but I'm also trying to read what you're saying. All these snow pokies are so cute. Whoa, oh, I have a snowball. Up, oh, up, no, up. No. Not good. So that's sort of what he was trying to say, is that you need to focus on first off knowing how to complete the course. If we try to go as fast as we can when we don't know where we're going, that's only going to lead to probably a lot of problems. There's also some spikes up this way. There we go. So it seems like this upper path is proving to be a good chunk quicker. Oh no, uh, I was a little bit silly with that. Let's try that again. Build up some speed, go down like that. Oh, I ran right into him. That's okay. Uh, after you clear it, I don't know what that said. Stop trying to talk to me, I wanna play the level, Ninji. You're not really helping too much. But that was actually pretty good. We'll try it again. But I do like the idea that there's multiple paths that helps us get around and figure out which one is the best. So slide through like that, jump off the snowball, fall down to my doom. Not what I wanted, but that's okay. We can make it work. Yeah, I definitely like all the new characters that have been out, all the new enemies and stuff. Another mushroom, I didn't quite need it, but I could've. Oh, uh, that's an endless pit. Not having a good time passing this level yet, but that's okay. We can just keep trying. And as we sort of get better. So definitely this upper path we need to stay on. Yeah, just like that. That's our best bet. And we're gonna die a lot as we, you know, of course try to master these levels, but the goal is clearly to die as little as possible. Whoop, oh, I didn't get as much air off of that one for some reason. Don't know what the dealio was. Whoa, okay, we were almost at the end. Darn, it looks like a lot of people got taken out there too. Okay, but we're so close. So we can definitely do this. If we wanted to be super extra risky and save some extra time, we could also just avoid getting the, the larger Mario in the first place. Don't think we need to do all that. Oh, come on, that was baloney. Got it, got it. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, I just gotta be very careful here. Oh, but I was on top of him. Ah, oh, sort of, I was sort of to the side of the top of him. That is so tough. Okay, one more time is all we need. Okay, so I made it all the way as large Mario. No, come on, that was just really unfortunate. Anyways, we made it at 29 seconds. So I definitely, tons of room for improvement there. Definitely towards the end, there was a couple of seconds I could have saved. I think I could definitely get that down to 25 seconds, but is that enough to open up a new level? I'm not really sure how this exactly works. Course clear, recon complete. And at 29 seconds, we are in a decent little tier. So I could play it again if I want. I think we'll go for it one more time. You can now race against Ninji Ghosts. Try to beat your personal record. You can adjust the number of Ninji Ghost Runners from the pause menu. Ooh, okay, so this is where it gets interesting. Once you beat the level, you have all these Ninji Ghosts from, oh my gosh, this is very disorienting. Ah, uh, um, I might have to lower the amount of Ninji Ghosts like it suggested because this is just too much. Too much, there's too much going on on the screen. But if I get ahead of them all, maybe it'd be a bit better. The problem is that I've already made some mistakes, so I'm not really competing with the fastest of them. Ah, and I died anyways. If I can get used to how messy it is at the very beginning, maybe I'll just try without the items this time. Oh, come on. Uh, we're going down this way. Everybody else is, whoop. Ah, I like the top play way better because there's no cramping going on. 
Because there, like, we, we just, like, bonked right into the... Can you stop doing that, Spike? I, I don't appreciate it. No! No! <laughs> I feel like I play worse with every try. <laughs> One more time with all the with all the ninjis. If it doesn't work this time, then I'll probably try to reduce them. Move out of the way. There we go. Okay, I'm ahead of that guy. That's it, that's it. Stay up here. Keep our momentum going. Got it. I mean, this is my first time today. This is my first time playing the Super Mario Maker or the new Super Mario Bros. play style in like months. So I'm hoping that as we work on this, we'll get a little bit better, a little bit warmed up to it. That wasn't too bad though. That was 24 seconds. I would have, uh, Spike, dude, um, I would have probably gotten around 25 seconds if I ran over that Spike or the, the Pokey. You know what I mean? There we go. But then that one snowball's messing me up. There we go. Okay. Okay, move it. Got it. Got it. Excellent. Ah, oh, I should have hit the snowball there. It is really tough. There we go. Come on, Mario. Keep going, keep going. Excellent. And then we just need to follow this one. That's it. Probably landing at the top wasn't the best, but 22.859 is by far my best. I don't know if the ninjas are still moving. It'd be funny if you could see them all catching up. I just love seeing this swarm of them running around like crazy. But we did pretty good. Course clear. And we got all the way up to almost silver. Okay. Well, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm fine with the silver placement right now. I'm just glad that we got in the top three. And because of that, we got the ninja cap. Cool. So is there other levels? No. <laughs> Wait, am I just supposed to do this all in one level? I'm a little confused. Stamp card. So that's the only level we have right now. Oh, wait, but I can, no. I didn't understand how this worked. I thought that maybe there'd be more than one speed run at once. I guess there's only one at a time? Isn't that a shame? Uh, but as you can see, how am I supposed to get others completed? I'm a little confused. If I do it again, I don't think I'm gonna get another thing, but I can try. I can try to get under 20 seconds. Ninji's incoming. Oh boy, that has me a bit worried. So I'm gonna try it again. You guys have already seen this, so I'm just gonna be right back once I do that. So I couldn't get a better time, but I did look into this on the official Mario Maker website. For this one, what apparently is supposed to happen is there's a period in time where there's a level for a challenge. That was between December 5th when the update first came out to December 12th, but it's been available since then. As you can see on the bottom of the picture, speed run complete. I guess they don't really have a word of when the next speed run is gonna start. I thought it was gonna be like a collection of levels, but who knows? So maybe every once in a while, every couple episodes, we can check out a brand new Ninji speed run. So the question is now, what do we do for the rest of today's episode? And I say, whatever we want. I wanna do something maybe not too crazy. I would like to continue our easy mode endless challenge. And we'll just do this for a little bit in today's episode. But yeah, let me know. Have you tried the Ninji speed run game mode? What are your thoughts on it? I think they should give us maybe more than one speed run or something. Like maybe it would be cool if there was like three different speed runs, like an easy, normal, hard or something like that. It feels like it's a little lackluster at the moment, especially since it seems like it's the same level that was released on December 5th. I'm a little late right now. I think it's like December 18th that I'm recording this. I'm not sure. Whoa! Oh, we're down here now. <laughs> So, it seems like they just need to add things a little bit more often. But anyways, let's get up this way and see what else is going on. Ah, uh, oh no, ah! Uh, this is like a haunted house ride, I like it. I don't know what the name of this level was, but so far it's really cool. Oh gosh, we're going off the rails! What's going on? Ah, jump! Up. Okay, not going that way. You're going to the pipe. This is really cool, it really is like a haunted mansion ride. Uh, let's not get attacked by the Wiggler. I'm going this way for now. It's hard, hard to see where we're going. It's very dark. Oh, there we go, ah! <laughs> All these different Psycats. And what's going on in here? Whoa, we're falling. Uh, let's go this way. There we go. Press this button and fall. No, 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 this time we actually didn't fall. Well, that's relieving. Okay, get this guy out of the way, maybe. At least a little bit. He's not chasing me now. Should I just keep running over here? I can, but 
I don't know if that's what I was supposed to do. Oh, we're in the corrupted world. Hey, it's giving me coins though. <laughs> Maybe the corrupted world isn't too bad. Huh, yeah, we definitely actually wanna get those one-ups, don't we? Yeah, I forgot, I haven't played the Endless Challenge in so long, I forgot how important one-ups are. I definitely wanna do more Endless Challenge episodes soon. I, I know I've been l lacking on the Mario Maker 2 content, I'm trying to change it up. I'm trying to get a little bit better at playing Mario Maker 2 more often. So how do I get back up? Can I just run from here? Yep. And then over this way, get up here no problem. How long is this level? This one goes on for a while. Apparently, I am not going up here. They fooled me. Uh, oh, ho, 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 I just barely made that. That was scary. Aha, there's the, the flagpole, hey, watch it. I can't do that, okay? I tried, I tried. Where do we go? This way. We we're so close to the end, too. But now we have made like a little path. Very cool. So there we go, our first level in our easy endless challenge for today. Not too bad. This is why I like the easy ones, because you just get to explore something a little bit different. Uh, but that was House of Spooks. I loved it. So, with that one done, we're moving on to another level. We'll have to see what it is. It's our new high score. Yeah, we've never been farther than this. Super Ball Blitz. Reached the goal after hitting four P-switches. We're gonna be playing with uh, Mario Land. Yes, we are. I love this music. So I guess, yeah, we have to run through this as quickly as we can, whenever it's available. Can't really blitz through this part, but I like the idea already. Sort of mixing together Super Ball stuff and also running around as fast as we can. See, I think I'm supposed to stand here as soon as this is done bouncing around. We go off those corners and now we can go. And now we just have to wait. <laughs> Honestly, it isn't too bad to set ourselves back up, but I'm sure it'll get more difficult as we go along. Okay. So going over here, what is our plan of action? Um. Oh, from here, yeah, gotcha. Pretty simple. Okay, should I try that again? I think so, maybe not. Oh, I can just go down this way now, okay. That makes a lot more sense. How do I do this? Just like that, run up quick, run up quick. Excellent. Hey, you don't wanna run out of time, you might be stuck. But come on, one more piece which left to find. I do not have a key, so I can't go through any of these doors. Huh, Wait, what do I do here then? Oh, do I go down the pipe? Of course. Ah, that was weird. Oh, these are all coins and stuff. Okay. Was that right? I suppose not. Okay, let, let that continue to bounce. And I throw that, but it didn't do anything. Now what? I guess I messed it up. Yeah, I know, clear condition incomplete. Oh, that's a flagpole right there, okay. So let's try from here. We get ourselves that, and then try this one, and we get that. Okay, not bad. Now we can go back through. And since we have this, we can start unlocking more stuff. So it looks like we're at the end, but we're actually not quite yet. What do I do now? Uh, go through this door. Yeah, that's sort of the ending of it right there. And now I'm here. Whoa, we did it! Hooray! <laughs> that was odd, but also super cool. So we're getting a nice variety of levels so far. I at least enjoy that. I was hoping for more with the speed running action, but this is a good uh, second best thing, for sure. So what is our next level? We'll try to get to level 30 in today's episode. How does that sound? So for level 27, what do we got going on? Sky fight. Hmm. So I'm, I can only presume this is a fight in the sky. Indeed, we have the fire clown cars. There's a lot of fire. It's a fire fight in the sky. Let's get rid of that Lakitu. And the Pokey. Oh, this must be a new level then, because the Pokies were just added, weren't they? Oh, two Bowsers. And Bowser Jr. Which one is the real Bowser then? Okay, let's just... <laughs> let's see if I can get away without fighting too much. Oh no, oh no, no! <laughs> they got me. And there we go, come on, quickly, quickly. Not too bad. So honestly, didn't have to do too much fighting. That was pretty good. I want the 49 lives. Wonder how much work we'd have to do to get to 99. Probably have to go on for a while. But yeah, with that one done, we are going to move to the next level. Some of them are, of course, quicker than others. Now we have uh, 
level 28 to do? I mean, I guess it's saying that we've done 28. Jeffy. All right. Not sure who that is. Okay. De Deoi? Is that an O or a D? I don't know. Oh, I don't know what's going on with this one. This one's weird. All right, well, there we go. That was easy. Some of these levels are weird, but of course they're made by all sorts of people. And they probably have like some certain context for a certain person that I just wouldn't understand. Anyways, next up, we have level 29 right over here. Maybe we'll, we'll go a little bit farther than level 30 because this is actually going by really quick all of a sudden. Maybe like level 35 or something. So now we have 50 lives, we're going in the Mario 3D world. Whoa. Oh, do I get the thwomp to squish all these these Goombas? I guess so, oh gosh. Oh gosh, it's getting very crowded very quickly. These are super easy now. <laughs> I made a couple of them though, like they were easy, but they were like also, they had like an interaction with them, but these ones are just like boom, bam, done. Which isn't a problem, I mean, you choose the easy, you get easy. But that's just interesting, how it just changed so quickly. Next up, level 31. What do we got this time for Mario to conquer? Oh, a pachinko machine? These are like things that are very popular in Japan. You like put a little ball down and it'll bounce between little pegs and sometimes you get lucky and you get stuff. It's, it's sort of like, like, a, like a pinball machine sort of, but also not really. Don't know how else to describe it though. I don't know what's going on just yet, but I like how it's Mario Sunshine music because there was a pachinko machine inspired thing in Mario Sunshine. Oh, so yeah, this is definitely sort of like a luck of the draw kind of thing. You just have to time it just right, and it'll bounce between all the pins in this point, in this, you know, example, they're actually more like question blocks, and they'll just sort of just go through. We got rid of a Koopa. I'm guessing we have to get rid of all five of them. This might take us some time, though. Okay, keep going. I don't know. A lot of them end up getting sent right back to us. But just ever so little adjustments in the timing of everything will totally change which way it goes. It's certainly not an easy thing, but definitely not a difficult thing. It's literally just luck of the draw, unless you're impeccably good at prediction and timing. Well, that's sort of hard to do with how quickly this thing bounces around. Almost, if that bounced around for a little bit longer. So I got the bottom two, which I have a feeling are easier than the top two, just with how the angling works here. Maybe if I change my positioning up a little bit. We'll definitely get like some radically different results and that one had the key, so I actually don't have to worry about him. See ya. <laughs> All right, that was great, but is that it? Um, Isn't this the same pipe we went through before? It's not, and as easy as that, we complete the level. Very, very cool, not too bad. I like that one, that one had a fun concept and interesting execution of it as well. So course clear, I'll give that one a like, and we're gonna move to the next one. So, 31 completed, now time for 32. Right over here. So what will 32 have for us? We have 54 lives, it's Mario 3 as well, so that's cool. Uh, okay, superstar. Keep running, maybe we should've done normal difficulty. I'm sorry to think that maybe we should do a couple levels in normal as well. Why not, we're just having fun today. I definitely wanna have more episodes specifically dedicated to endless mode, oh no, okay. That star power came in a little too late. That's okay with me. Oh, now our super shoe. Out of the way, out of the way, out of level to complete, yeah. All righty. So we'll at least get the 35 on easy, and then we'll see if we can't do a couple of normal levels as well. That's because I wanna make things, you know, as jam-packed as possible. We still, of course, have more episodes coming up. So 32 done. And it just keeps going forever. I do sometimes miss a 100 Mario challenge. I like the idea of having an end goal to it. Wow, we got more lives than that, so we're up to 57. This keeps going up and up. Oh, Nintendo 64. Uh, I'm just gonna keep running to the right. I have a feeling that's what I was supposed to do. Uh, so far, so good. Don't look back. Don't slow down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> keep going. This is at least really cool looking, and we got it. Excellent. Short and sweet with that one too. That's honestly the first like runner level I've seen in a while, so I don't mind those like every once in a while, you know? If they were like every single level, that'd be sort of a little overwhelming. 
but they're not. That, that was, I feel like that was more of an issue in the original Mario Maker. But this is level 34, and we have one more after this. Okay, back to the Mario 3D world. Whoa, look at that. I haven't seen this guy in an underwater level before. That looks really cool. Uh, gotta be careful. Well, let's go through this pipe. It seems to be a bit faster. I don't know what that piece which I activated it is doing. I guess it didn't really need to do anything. Level over. <laughs> okay. That's a really cool theming of the underwater 3D world. Looks so nice. Hope that we see more levels like that in the future. Okay, so next up, we should have one more level to go. Right here, new high score, very nice. So, this one's from Japan, very cool. Oh, more 3D world under the water, but in the jungle. This theme is always so pretty. She's sort of like chained up, ah! Okay, just barely turned that around. I mean, unless the game did that for me, that was weird. That was really weird. But I survived. <laughs> that was that was just a big trap. Why did I do that to me? Anyways, where will this lead? Duh! Oh, right here. <laughs> Not very far compared to where I was. Is there any way to hit this? Um, I don't know. Gotta be honest, this is a bit of a bizarre level, especially with the collection of cat bowsers, meowsers, right? I think that's what a lot of people were calling them. Let's keep going. Ah, ah! Nope, be gone. Be gone, Bowser, and Bowser, and don't forget Bowser. Okay, dodge him, please. How far do we gotta go? <laughs> Did I miss something? Uh. Keep going, Mario. Ready, jump and dive. Will that work? Not really. I don't like this very much. How much farther do we have to go? It's just a gauntlet of somersaulting Bowsers. Oh, here we go, we're almost there. Sort of, maybe, potentially, yes. Yes, get out of the water. Ow, we finally got hit, but it's a little too late for you, Bowser. So there we go, that was our 35th level in the easy mode. We'll do a couple on normal, because this is getting a little too simple for us, I think. I think our skills are sharpening again. So we're gonna move out of this. Still a lot of fun. There we go, new high score. We are going to quit. Yep, progress will be saved, that's good to know. And, Let's go to normal mode, which, ah, we failed normal mode at some point, didn't we? Okay, well, let's just try to get a good start with this. Mario embarks on a journey. Well, good luck, Mario. Okay, let's get to it. But maybe we'll finish everything off after we do a couple levels, like five of these. Maybe we'll try one more time with being a little bit more warmed up uh, at the Ninja speed run, see if we can't beat our own time. Okay, huh. Oh, is this like a timing thing? Do I have to be quick with this? Well, let's find out. Oh no. Oh, I really do. I really do, but I made it. Not bad, not bad. Oh, that's a Koopa. Not good. But I do get a mushroom. These arrows are telling me something. I don't know what they're telling me. Koopa, can you go into that one? Let's see, uh, let's see how that works. Oh, I guess I chose the right one. Maybe. I don't know how to feel about this. Looks like it, okay. I gotta get up there, don't I? I get lots of coins, that's good. Let me grab these now because who knows, you know? <laughs> Might need them later. And what's up this way? Not much of anything, but I can jump around with the spring if I needed to, which it looks like I don't need to. I just need to maybe do that. I'm a little confused on how I get up there. There might be some invisible box though, so I could try that as well. Whoop. Oh, darn. Maybe I can triple jump? It looked like, oh, there's something up there. There's like fireballs. I need the spring not to move back here for whatever reason. This is super weird, but I might be just doing it wrong. Yep, I am, okay. I was overcomplicating it, but you never really know, do you? So can I, yep, get another one. Ah, no, wait, 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 wait. There we go. So I wanna be careful about this. Uh, There we go, get rid of all those Koopas. And I could go down here now. And that, that turtle show goes where I cannot follow. 
Oh, here's the star. Oh, there's Bowser. Get out of here, Bowser, and everyone. Ah! <laughs> no, no, no! Oh, I went too fast. Darn. Okay. Slow and steady this time. Oh boy. I don't have any more star power, but that, that's fine. I don't need it too much. Okay, I'm very worried about this. We have this sort of field of different Koopas going on. I'm just gonna try to jump on the Koopas while keeping up with everything else. Hiya. <laughs> okay, that got rid of a couple of them. Don't have to worry about it. Oh, here we go, here we go, ready? Jump, and I made it. Very cool. So that was a bit treacherous, but after the first try, we figured it out, and that's always good. So with that done, the course is clear. That's the first of several we wanted to do, though. Level one. <laughs> and next up, level number two. But we, we ended up gaining more lives than we went in with, so that's good, we have seven now. Thwomp's Revenge. What did I do to the Thwomp? I mean, Thwomp's usually pretty angry. I Probably just me existing. Oh, wow. Okay. I don't know how to feel about this. This is very crowded. Uh, Jump for it. Go into this pipe. There are thwomps everywhere. Luckily, I get a checkpoint, though. I didn't mean to go back down the pipe. But I guess I could check things out. The Whoa, maybe this wasn't a bad idea. Oh, oh, okay. Don't know if that's what I was supposed to do, but it worked. Oh, okay, I think there might have been more, but they maybe didn't think about that players might go back. I like it. All right. Let's go to the next level. 15 second clear time with that one. Okay, so we didn't get any lives though. It's sort of a problem. That's definitely something we need to also focus on. Don't know what this one is about. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a hammer. Very cool. We also have the timed blocks and the Koopa destroy. Hmm. Oh gosh, we have a Thwomp, gotta be careful for him. Hup. Can I, can I do that? Yes, I can, <laughs> excellent. Oh, but I can't do that. Oh no, there goes our Mario Maker ability. Huh, oh, is it in here? It's not. Then I'm a little confused about what we do. I need a key somewhere. Oh, the ink guy ran off. That's fine. He wasn't really doing me any favors. I can't really get to the top of it. Is that the problem? Let me go back. Because I must have missed the key somewhere, right? I don't know. This is one of those ones where it's like, what do you do? <laughs> I'm not really sure at the moment, be careful. Okay, throw that down there, doesn't do much. Oh, he's not happy. Oh, okay. That was very fortunate. I'll use that to go through this door, I guess. What about all the other places that had a keyhole? No, wait, it's back here? Oh, no, that wasn't very productive. Well, that was the worst place to spend the key. Oh no, oh, Pom Pom's here, oh great. <laughs> pom Pom's trying to chase me down. I'm going to leave her be and instead, going through some color coordinated pipes. And there we go, we're at the end of the level. I feel like there was a lot of the level I missed there. Very peculiar, but also very interesting. Some cool ideas going on. I like the color coded pipes. All right, what's next? That was level three completed, two more to go. Let's a go indeed, Mario. Let's a go. Super Mario Bros. 3 Level 1. So I'm guessing this person probably remade Mario 3 Level 1 here in, yes he did, in Mario Maker 2. That's such a cool idea. I always like seeing that because you know, of course Mario Maker 2 has some little tiny differences. I definitely wanna play Mario Maker, or Mario 3. <laughs> I'm playing Mario Maker right now. I definitely wanna play Mario 3 one day for you guys because such a fun game. Haven't played it in like forever. But one of these blocks should have, I might have missed it. Ah, I guess I did. Hmm. But yeah, one of these blocks should have the Tanuki leaf so that we can fly around with that. But I don't quite see it. Oh well, we'll just keep going. Maybe one of these? Aha, found it! Oh no, oh, don't lose it immediately, please. <laughs> but if I run real fast, of course, we can go super speed and get up this way. And what's going on with all that? We get an extra one up. And I think somewhere around here, there should be some big pipes in the sky, or not. Oh, they give you a checkpoint. <laughs> that definitely wasn't in the original. 
And where do these pipes go? Oh, so it is a little bit different. It's like slightly remixed. I sort of like that idea. I sort of went into it the wrong direction now. So I'm just gonna grab my one up and leave. Be careful of the Koopas who are falling down on me. Cause I'm pretty sure that some of this is a good chunk different. Like there's not that big pile of bricks that you usually throw a uh, Koopa shell at. But we should be coming up on the end soon, right? I don't know. Whoop, whoop, got it. Oh no, here it is. Oh no, I need the Koopa shell back. Oh, it's gone. Oh well. Maybe they'll show back up if I, yes they will. So what I gotta do here, it's just that. And that'll give us a P switch, which of course, oh gosh, lots of stuff happened there, we can use to go through this door. That's a little bit different than the original too. I like it though, I like the little differences. Where does this lead? Now I'm really curious. Right where we were. Super cool ideas with this one. It feels familiar, but fresh. Cool. Okay, I grabbed that coin right at the end. And we, of course, got three one-ups, so we are good to move to the next level without any problems. Definitely, I like that one. And let's see what's next. Level number five, the final one we'll do in the normal endless before we try one more time at the Ninji speed run. Let's hope this one isn't super tough. Seven one. So this one's probably part of a string of levels that this user's created. Oh, and it definitely is like a mountain type thing. Oh, this is crazy. It's like a mountain rock, but also like an airship type level with the auto scrolling and the, the Monty Moles. Huh. Oh gosh, lots to keep up with here. I might end up falling to my doom here if I'm not careful. There we go. Oh, I missed out on some coins. Oh, but I landed right on the, on the wrench. Darn. <laughs> Let's try that again. This one definitely looks to be a bit difficult. Oh boy, what am I doing, what am I doing? But these are supposed to be like big tanks, I think. Really lovely idea. Okay, so I missed out on this before, it's a mushroom. <laughs> That's probably where most of my struggles came from. So let's just try to do as well as we did before, but now with a mushroom, that way when I inevitably mess up, I'll be okay. There we go, bounce off of all of that. It's the wrenches you gotta be really careful of because with those, Oh man, it is, it is no going back. They're so small too, they can be hard to spot when you're moving around like crazy trying to dodge everything else. There we go. Oh, not bad. <laughs> we're keeping up pretty well. It really does have like the look as if we're standing in place and everything else is moving. So they, they nailed that effect really well. Can we get rid of these guys? I don't know, it's too late now. Oh, oh come on. There goes our fire ability. Get the checkpoint quick. Excellent. And another fire flower. There we go. And there's the end, we made it. That might be my favorite level of the day. It just had like this cool atmosphere to it. It felt like something that could be in a Mario game. It was just like a fun little idea. All right, well course clear for that, I like it. And we were only a second behind the world record because it's an auto scrolling level, of course. You can only go so fast in those. So with that done, I've had a lot of fun with the endless challenges today. We'll give one last attempt at the Ninji speed run to see if we can't best our time of about 22 seconds. And I will try to be back to you know do the other Ninja speed runs whenever they become available, because right now there's no active speed runs, there's just the very first one. I was hoping they'd be at least available every week then, but maybe every other week? Ninjis incoming. I do wanna pause the game to see how much we can adjust the amount of ninjis running around. Can we add more? That would be hilarious if we could just add a ridiculous amount. So right as it starts, I'm going to pause and take a look, ninja ghosts, a swarm, a bunch, a few. So you can't do more than a swarm. You can't do an army. Okay, so we're gonna do this as small Mario, and what we wanna do is just jump up, bounce off of that, bounce off of that. No, okay, I didn't, uh, this is going bad. There we go, okay. We're turning it around. Might not be the best time ever, especially with you ruining me like that, but. We're doing pretty good for it being like our first, oh, try. I lost track of myself between the ninjas. We'll keep going until we complete it. Oh, the snowballs every stinking time. Oh, come on, that was baloney. So I don't think we're gonna be able to get a better time, at least not this attempt, especially when I'm doing those mistakes. Whoa, whoa, I don't even know where I'm going right now. Oh, that was not the best path. There are some ninjas definitely getting ahead of me now. Come on, come on, come on, go! And then push that, and then keep going! 
<laughs> okay, that would have been slower anyways. I think I'm gonna throw in the towel with that. I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat 22 seconds, but I've had a lot of fun with this. Definitely let me know your best time for the rolling snowballs level. Very, very fun. Hopefully they keep the old levels when they introduce new ones, and hopefully while along with that, we can get some new stuff. But I do wanna check out the ninja cap then before we finish off everything for today. So if we go to our maker thing, just like that, change our outfits, there should be a brand new hat waiting for us somewhere around here. That's odd, I don't see it. Oh no, it might be down here. There it is, ninja cap, super cute. I love all the colors, wow. Okay, so definitely lots of fun. But with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Super Mario Maker 2. Before you go, be sure to comment Ninja Zebra so you've watched at the end that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.